Let's wrap up with commodities. The 15th African Fine Coffee Conference and Exhibition is opened in the Ethiopian capital, Addis Ababa. Now over 2,000 coffee exporters, roasters, traders, producers and connoisseurs from the continent and beyond will be discussing how to reshape the industry. The event will also feature exhibits from right across the value chain and that includes traders, coffee tech providers, you name it, you'll find it there. That said, the Ethiopian president, Mulatu Tashome, pointed to the event's significance to small-scale coffee farmers at the opening ceremony. In order to benefit the coffee farmers and also to encourage all stakeholders in the coffee industry, we came to recognize that new markets must be identified and nurtured to full potential. In this regard, China, Russia, the Middle East, South Korea and the Far East economies, Australia and consuming African countries of Algeria, Tunisia, among others, offer a lucrative option and price incentives to the Ethiopian coffee. In Tanzania, we produce two types of coffees. We are producing fine Arabicas and we are also producing fine Robustas. So with this conference, all the buyers who are buying coffees from us, we are getting a chance of meeting them, talk to them, show to them what we have. So it's a good opportunity for us. This is a very wonderful conference because we have met different people, different background and traditional beliefs about the coffee. Secondary, we have, it, it gives the value addition of the coffee and also people to know the best machine for, the, for popping the coffee.